Okay. <laughs> I don't need to do the intro thing, right? No. Okay, cool. Um, we're sitting here in uh, our dyno cell at Enthmoto. Uh, this is a STC 53 rated uh, sound absorbent room. I, don't, I guess I don't know the perfect technical term to that, but um, it's uh, a sound enclosure and airflow uh, sealed room, meaning like it is ducted to the roof of the building, uh, so it is entirely separate from the main shop area. Um, that way we're not uh, disrupting what's going on in the normal work area and able to be in here uh, for a long period of time and do really heavy calibration work on the cars. Uh, some of the cool technical aspects of the room, the fan system is able to move 74,000 CFM at full boogie. Um, it's operated via an adjustable uh, controller uh, off some VFDs. So we can run that at whatever rate we want to with the idea being uh, that amount of CFM. It's a it's a high volume, low velocity style uh, room. So it's not that we're in a, in a wind tunnel in here, but we're able to completely exchange all of the air in the room uh, several times per minute. And that allows the engine to breathe clean, uncontaminated air, um, which becomes a big deal when you're talking about power levels as high as what these cars are. You know, 2,000, 3,000 plus wheel horsepower consumes a lot of air. And, uh, and it needs to be clean air, not exhaust contaminated air, which um, exhaust is inert, the, the oxygen is gone then, so um, it won't perform appropriately, your calibration is not accurate, um, all of those different aspects. Uh, so very, very neat. Uh, side bonus, um, I don't get headaches nearly as bad anymore, um, so that's really nice, so maybe we'll live a couple of years longer. Um, but no, in all seriousness, it's a um, we wanted to do the dyno facility what we would call the right way, um, much in line with the way we like to build the cars, as a OE level facility, because we try to achieve OE level type vehicle builds. Um, so uh, it's also a fantastic diagnostic ability in here because uh, whether you can notice from this video or not, um, because of the sound attenuation capability, you hear a lot of things in here that you don't normally hear outside in the normal uh, environment. Um, valve train noises, exhaust leaks, uh, I mean, any number of things are much, much easier to identify in here quickly uh, than what it is in, the, uh, in a normal environment. So that's a really cool side bonus that we didn't necessarily anticipate on, but really, um, in some cases rely on now. So it gets you pretty spoiled um, once you've been working in, in, a, in a dyno facility like this. Um, it's, it's pretty hard to not want to be in something like this all the time then, uh, both from the data aspect and the health aspect at that point. The sound attenuation aspect, that's really fantastic because uh, just on the other side of the wall is um, you know our working area, fabrication area, all that. Uh, instead of uh, rattling the roof panels off the place and all of that and disrupting everybody in the normal workday, we can be making pulls in here and you can be right on the other side of the wall and uh, it's, it's not really that big of a deal. Um, that's a pretty incredible benefit for anybody that's either in this industry or been near a dyno cell or a dyno operating at full tilt, especially at more and more elevated power levels. Um, that's not normal, you know, it, it pretty well shuts down the shop if it's just in the open workspace at that point. I mean, that's not something that we wanted to be able to do. So we've got one of our uh, Enfimoto Zenith Series twin turbo nine liter cars in here idling away, and we're able to be on the outside of the room with no real impact to us as far as a noise level, but uh, inside it's quite a bit different. On top of that, it also allows us to operate at just about any hour that we need to, because uh, let's face it, we're dealing with race cars. They don't always go as planned, and sometimes you're uh, you're running a little late on the hours, um, uh, so uh, not having the neighbors have to worry about it either, because even the exhaust air itself is muffled through a system before it exits out the facility. So uh, 
tons of benefits and something that we wanted to show you guys a little bit more about here at Nth Moto.